Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Underrail Expedition. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today, uh, as I remember that I have a mission to do. And also we have rat hounds around here. Did you hear that? So I need to shoot a rat hound with a bolt Quinton gave me and collect a tissue sample. We can do that, can't we? We have a putrefying crossbow thingy. Of course we can. Uh, also, what did I just click? I clicked on the wrong thing. Ooh. Oh, the that's the attack button. Right, right. So we are exploring the lower caves. That's the name of this place. We can also look at the map and uh, see that we have a thing to look over there. And you can hear the rat hounds. And also I have uh, low enough health that it matters that I use the bandage. No, it doesn't, actually. Bandages are really good. 140 health, that is supremely good. Hi. I'm really bad. Hi. Hi, hi. Please don't do that. No, no. No, back fighting. No, no, don't do that. That's mean. How do I shoot you with a putrefying bolt? Action points 29. I have that. Hmm. Hmm. Let's, let's try that again. I, I, yeah. Also, this is dangerous to be in here. Um, so, we have... Oh, I... Hi. I see. The game actually explains how to use that, but... Uh, yeah, so I can now use the putrefying bolts on you. 59. And did it. I did it. So now you need to die. Can I do it again? I can't. I will uh, try to get away from here because you guys are mean and will kill me. Critical hit immediately. That guy I don't think can reach. I think there's another one coming over here. This is dangerous, but I'll do it. I'll do it because I know he'll die. And I think I can leave midway through combat. I, I remember that being a pretty serious exploit uh okay so let's take one of these just like that it healed for 80 rather than 82 i don't know how much health i had uh and i can still Ooh, I, can, I can do that and attack twice that's really good uh that also means that i will need oh man these critical hits are pain there's definitely another rat moving though okay I'm out of combat. Okay, it's going to stealth. Okay, we pulled it off. Um, a a apart from needing to actually collect the remains, so the 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 remain the rat disappears if there's no remains, and also putrefied. Shouldn't it be? You know that that uh, that is I think correctly written. Uh, putrefied rat hound tissue. I did it. I did it. I did it. Which means we're gonna be able to learn a thing. Can you believe it? I will be able to learn a thing. I don't actually know. It. No, not that. Can we? The game is a little bit unresponsive in regards to dragging and dropping. Just saying. It's like if you need to long hold and drag and drop. Long hold? Long click and then drag and drop. Okay. So that guy's over there. There's a lot of them. So if I do that before, that applies the temporal distortion, which takes two turns to, to take effect, which might allow me... I should have stopped sneaking, or do I stop sneaking automatically? I don't know what it's, what's going to happen. So I'll attack once. And flee for the life, for my life, over there. There you go. And it, you can see over here, it's going to take some damage, but it's not enough. Holy crap. I think it might have been quite enough. I don't know if it's coming still. Oh, finally a critical for 35. That's what I'm talking about. Can I exit combat? I can indeed. We did it. We pulled it off. Ah, learning to use the, that ability now. A little bit. Sneak a little bit as well. Man, we got through that one without taking damage? I'm, I'm getting better at this. 
And I have putrefied meat, which is the best thing. More than anything, we're at a place where... Southgate outposts. <laughs> uh, we're at a place where we might find some um, oddities beside the, the rats. Speaking of which, hi. You're mean and I don't like you. So, yeah, we, we might just want to go with a punch and stay around because I think... No, the, the staying around doesn't actually uh, increase the dodge. Speaking of which, I'm also uh, back down under there. Okay, so we might have to learn how to take care of that particular issue of health. This is locked. Oh, man. Can I, is there another way of getting in there? Maybe there is. There's a power switch in there, which means this is one of the things that we need to open. I can't do... No, no, I can't use keys or anything on that. Okay. Well, we need to come back anyway, so... Let's go... No, actually, let's kill this rat. And then I'll figure out how to use my bed or something to heal or maybe I can go to the uh, medical place and just heal because of course that can be done without uh, compromise wasn't there a rat back here oh maybe without compromising the um, the flow of the let's play because I can just make cuts the beauty of you of YouTube no not you oh no that is I am glad that I saved because I am about to die I think no, actually, I'm not. Well, I'm. I'm I, I might be a little bit. Um, health hypo. Yeah, let's take one. And move a little bit. There's four of them. Yeah, this was. This would be a prime place to. Uh, to oh, <laughs> right. Uh, we can give it a try. That's really nice, actually. Back hunting that uh, its damage attack skills are increased. Yeah. Ooh, I'm literally dead. I'm not literally dead. That is really nice. Let's keep at it. Please kill it. Oh, yes, that's what I'm talking about. <gasps> no! I am dead. Let's find out if I am indeed. Let's see what happens when we die. We fall over. You have died and have to load a saved game. <laughs> Yes, yes, that is that is what. Oh, well, I don't have to. Don't you don't you can tell me what to do, game. Uh, anyway, uh, we're in a good position now to go back and finish that mission and learn a lo another ability, especially because I think it's thermodynamics or thermophysical things, uh, which is good because uh, I'm gonna be able to throw fireballs. Range is always very important. So uh, let's go to the SGS and let's see if we can convince these fools to heal us for free. I think we can. I'm pretty sure we can. So, Pasquale, how's it going? Hello, Carrie. Indeed, could you take a look at my injuries? Of course, that's why I'm here. We'll have to fi have you fixed in no time. Absolutely, please do. And that's what I'm gonna do for a long part. A long part for a long while. 60 health, that's exactly how much. How did you know, doctor? Yeah, it, it's a. It's not actually, it doesn't take too long to get here. Um, we do need to go to, is it Cyber Labs? Or is it Agronomy? I don't know. Uh, yeah, it doesn't take too long to get here. It is here. I, I, but yeah, I, I did the right thing. So this fellow over here, Quinton, um, he wanted the putrefied meat, and we have that. Forgot something! Uh, no, I, my, here's the tissue sample you wanted. Excellent! Give it to me! Or give it here. I'm going to resume my test right away. Yeah, don't forget my training. Oh, yeah, yes, of course. Just let me know when you're ready to begin your lessons. Uh, right now? It's the... right? Ah, uh, of course. Meth 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 Methothermics are my speciality. I can teach you cryokinesis, cryokinesis, whatever, cryostasis, pyrokinesis, or the other way around, pyrokinetic stream, and that's that. That's, that's the four. 
Uh, yeah, tell me about cryokinesis or cry kinesis. Uh, yeah, yeah. Basically, it's uh, any process that involves materializing and launching ice projectiles. Most commonly, the projectile takes the form of a pointy shard. Aside from causing direct harm, it will also disperse cold vapors on the on impact. It will cost you 50 credits to learn. Uh, no, it won't. I I still have a freebie. Oh, I was hoping you forgot. Uh, let's begin your lesson then. And there we go. We learn our lesson. And I gained... Oh, yep. Did I gain one? Wait. I gained one experience from completing the quest. I didn't know that's how it worked. How did I forget about that? That's really nice. That is super good. So, let's go to our private quarters because one of the ways that I played the game the first time around was by basically leaving all of my crafting equipment in here. All of it. Just came up in here and dropped it all. Uh, mostly because I didn't know what I was going to need, but also uh, that was the correct way of, of doing it. Uh, so I will carry you around, actually. Uh, I shouldn't? Yeah, because this is persuasion. So serrated bolts and all these things, they're meant to be sold, so I'll sell them eventually. Uh, these are food... But do we actually need food? K pauper meat should not be consumed raw. It's much tastier in the form of cooked meat. Oh, cooked meal, yeah. So. Because we are. Oh, it, it's consumables. Right, and you have lake mushrooms. Two pounds worth of lake mushrooms. And also a burrower burger. Okay, and this is the crafting. Right, right, right. Oh, wait. I forgot to learn about the tactical vest, which is actually quite important, because uh, I don't know if I need any of these. Uh, so, yeah, and also I might be able to, to make it right now, so that's not the key. That is the key the tactical vest requires. A carrier vest, a ballistics panel, an armor plate, and an overcoat fabric. These are optional over here. So, I, the vest, I know how to identify it, but uh, the ballistics panel is probably that. That probably works. You can mix and match. Uh, but we don't have any right here. So these are all components. And I can't... They don't automatically... Don't they automatically populate? Is that not how it works? Yes. Yes, it is. Ampuload flat beaker. Cool. We need biology at 40, though. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. I, I'm remembering now how it works. So I will leave everything here. Uh, right click, let double click, shift click. Nope. Control click. Alt click. Oh yeah. Very important to know these shortcuts. And uh, just drop everything. Because that's all for crafting. And then tools, we have all the things that we need or might need or don't need at all. Uh, and uh, that's that. Let's get out of here. Our carry weight is back up to 29. We're back down to 29. And we're back upstairs. So now that I know this thing, materialize it, it does so much more damage. It is so much better. It's the same speed that the action points is, but um, the... No, actually, it's slower. But I can attack it twice. It does a lot more damage, though, uh, because of the mechanical associated damage. And it also freezes the enemies, which is really good. Uh, I should probably sneak, though. Because you never know with these guys. Also, how do I... Can I put that over there? Oh, it switches back around. Just like that. That's pretty cool. I like it. Okay. Uh, because applying two of these might be... Because it does extra 220 damage. Hmm. Using that might be a good thing if you know it's going to take a while to kill the, cre the creature. But we'll learn it. Oh, also I should have my, uh, my fingers on the, the enter key. Okay, that's a rat hound. Can I attack? So the range of that is actually higher than the temporal distortion. So you can see the uh, what if what the effects are. The movement is slowed down and things. That's pretty good. So now I want to kill you. Right. Critical hit is very welcome, especially because I can attack that guy back there. That said, I might want to apply this. So basically, places a debuff on the target, 
that lasts two turns and deals 6.9 damage. That's uh, 6.9, 6 to 9. That's basically 12 to uh, 18 damage when it expires. In 12 to 18 is nice. But is it worthwhile? Because the thing is, you need to use this, you definitely need to, to, st to uh, you know, to st stack it. Which you can do. The thing is, I don't know if it stacks. I don't know. What, what happens is, basically, like, it doesn't do damage next turn. So the Rat Hound is going to reach me and do damage before it dies. The thing is, I don't know if I, if I, by applying a new one, it resets the counter. Or it just takes over. Like, for example... Um, imagine I shot it over here right now and the next turn it wouldn't do anything and the second turn it would do damage so if I shot it when it was over there would it do damage more because I shot it over there or would it not matter uh, is my is what I'm wondering right now so I'm, I'm gonna stick to cryogenics over here or cryokinesis kinesis. the first time I saw that I, I remember the first time I saw that attack against me uh, and it is pretty scary ow Okay, pack, pack hunting is a problem. So now I apply this. And I apply that again. And then I punch you for 70%. Yeah! I'm badass. And hopefully I don't die. Or, it's not necessarily about dying, but... Yeah. So... It's still better to just do the... Even at this range. That wasn't even a critical, that was just normal damage. So I got unlucky that the first that the dog the first dog caught me at all. Huh, interesting. 25 damage. So I imagine they have 50 damage exactly because that guy took 24 and 26. Huh. And I had just enough. Also, I diversified a little bit. So that was very good. I did take a little bit of damage, but you know, it's, it's we, we do what we can with what we have. And I, I think we have plenty good. This is so much different, though. This Like, the capability of surviving without having to be so finicky as I was the first time around with the, with the combat. I was super finicky all the time. Because it was so dangerous. Combat was super dangerous. So we got rocks over there. We can't go anywhere with that. Uh, it could be that there's explosives in there. But without the uh, oddities, I'm not going to be able to, to get in there. Which is fine. We can we remember that. Uh, yeah. There's there's no there's no other passage. Let's find another passage. There's this passage over here in the fly area, just over to the west. Uh, but I don't remember if I took it. I think I didn't. I did not. And there's a red hound. I don't know if this is the right idea. No, no, no. Oh. It super isn't. Okay. The rat hounds don't open doors. Gotcha. Uh, the game is doing things that I don't want it to do. No, don't do things that I don't want you to do, game. What the heck? Uh, well, it's not really... That's not really what's happening. It's just that I... I, I I should have realized what that meant, the lines on the floor. I can sneak. Oh, it takes a little while to start to be able to sneak as you enter an area. Uh, yeah, the lines on the floor should have been obvious. Hi. Hello. Aren't you a cute one? Yes, you are. So, a very... Oh. A very cheesy way of... Um... Hmm. Yeah. I can just leave. That's the cheesy way. And it's 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 definitely effective. Okay. Need a little control in your face. And that's that. Can I leave? I can't. Let's just stick around. I should have punched you a little bit. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. These guys don't mess around. But they die. We got Oh no, you can't do anything. Shut up. I'm looking at the remains over here. Let me get the remains. Ah, oh, some glands and whatnot. And there you go. Can you leave me alone? Apparently not. Is he actually coming this way? Well, I'll need 
Yeah, I don't want to use the the hypodermics. Hi. Oh, there's more. Oh, yeah. I probably will need to use the hypodermics. Please kill. Thank you. Two. Oh, but 26 and a 28. That's relatively okay. I should be able to leave even if there's, especially if there's two of them. So that's a 26 right there. And a 25. We're still in combat. Oh, no, we're not. What? I, did they fix it? Or what happened? Did I forget? 29 is nice. Did I forget how it works? We're still in combat. I think this is going well. 24. That's bad. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, this is super going badly. Yeah, I'll, I need to leave. See you later. There's a lot of them. Huh. Okay, well, that settles it. I'm using that. For 82. I'm saving here before it saves on the other side. Because I think it saves at the beginning of the area rather than at the end. Which means rather... Oh. Yeah, that's something I have to contend with. But I'm I'm happy with that. that that's not a problem. Uh, see if I can kill you. I probably can't. Okay. Oh, I thought I was... Okay, I can punch you a little bit more. Not enough action points. Curious. There we go. And, yeah, they're all dead. We pulled it off. A lot of dogs. Okay. The good thing about this oddity system, besides just being cool, that you... you know, I like it. I like it a lot. The good thing is that you're not forced to kill the... Well... It's not that you're ever forced, but when you're going around and you find animals and uh, enemies, you're not forced to uh, to kill them because the experience. Uh, although we will kill them all because the safety is a good thing. So we're currently at 61. I have 21% more health to uh, to go through if I want to uh, heal with a bandage, which I probably want. This is the power generator. Flux controller missing. Flux controller inserted successfully. Power generator is operational. And hopefully we'll have an oddity over there, which is likely. Yes, we do! Another border guard orders to kill everyone, especially Gorkus. Gorky. Gorski? That's the one. Uh, and uh, it's very nice. Also, what is that? Why is there a door to nowhere? There's a lot of... There's a lot of things like that in this game. So it's not a surprise. It's not a bug or anything. And I never even opened that door. Maybe it's locked. It is not. Hmm. Junk pile. Boxes. I like this. A trap. I th I, if I remember correctly, the traps are very, very important to use. Is that... Uh... Oh, yeah. That's not... They're very important to use. Uh, but I never did, because I'm a cheapskate, mostly. Also because, yeah. Oh, hi! Hello! Can I do this? I can't do this. Can't do anything else. Okay, I'll just stick around over here. Oh, they're, aren't they nice? Yes, they are. So, projectiles don't, don't work. But this is not a projectile. Pistols? Pro oh, look at that. The game did a weird thing. Yeah, if I'm very fast with the selection, the, the game does a weird thing when it comes to uh, to actually, you know, using the ability I selected. So I need to be very careful with that. Huh. It's good to know, that thing. We got a power switch. Just like that. Just like that. What do we have? We have our level up. That's what we have. And also health. Ooh, that makes noise. Uh, and also... Did they ch I think they changed the ammo, the way the ammo looks. It looked... I, I don't know. I don't remember them. Uh, the ammo looking like that. Uh, that requires hacking of 15. Well, that's a good thing. Because we are about to level up. 
And we are going to also hack that. Uh, so, level up. Zero points. One feet right. Also, why? Is I empathy? Wait, well, oh no, I get that. But that's right. I got that just from acquired outside leveling. It says right there as well on the right side. Uh, anyway, what are we? What we are currently at forty. That is sort of good. What's not good is the fact that I don't remember what I am going to be using. So, uh, metathermics more than anything. What kind of school is that? Metathermics, right? That's the school. So, um. We're going to want to have lockpicking at that and that. So we're going to have at least this to just be able to do something, at least. Uh, and if I want to persu want persuasion, which I probably do, we we'll probably want those as well. Uh, and we're probably going to want to the, uh, bring these up as well, biology for later, uh, because of the crafting that we're going to be in need of doing. Let me try. You must spend all... Yeah. Okay, okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. I know I, I know what I'm doing. No, I don't. Uh, what I want to do, though, is I want to see... Does he not tell me the requirements? He doesn't tell me the requirements if I don't have the, uh, the necessary ingredients. That's a bit of a shame. Anyway, well, that's that. And I'm just going to level up my metathermics as much as I can, which is not much. So it's only by five. That's important to remember. Uh, which probably means that I want to level up all of these so I can learn them as soon as possible. Uh, but also I can try and go up on persuasion. Or... I can bring these up to there. these sure oh that's kind of nice sure I think that's good enough yeah because th that that's uh, proccing off of will apparently my god that is a lot that is a lot I think it's gonna go up very fast look at this thing I'm a 20 and I'm effectively 30 that is pretty amazing but more amazing is the fact that we have a feet point. I don't know if we gain one feet per level up. I hope we do, because I have a lot of feats that are, that are really cool. Uh, and what we're going to go with immediately is Tranquility, which requires us to um, have full health. Uh, so it's going to be... It, it's pretty good because it, it, it reduces the action point cost. So we're going to be uh, we're gonna be able to do a thing or two regarding our survivability. But we do, me we do need to use... Uh, we do need to be a full health. And our health went up by... So... 18, I think? Yeah. So, it's pretty good. I'm very happy with that. Now, let's get to hacking. At least I hope let's get hacking, because I might have done the uh, calculations wrong. Let's hack this stuff. And the energy goes down. I don't know how much it goes down. I think like 10 each time? Oh, 5 each time. That's perfect. In here, we have a pistol. A hawker. I remember using this one quite a lot. Uh, can we unload it or anything? There's, it's not like that. Okay. I don't think... I think you can. And it's precisely by right-clicking, as I was doing. But, yeah, you that one is not loaded. So there we go. We leveled up. We can go back to that uh, lockpicking place. And I will go back to that lockpicking place. But I will do that off-camera. As I always do. But that's not the thing. I will do that off-camera off because we're out of time for the day. So for right now, I'm Colonel RPG. And this has been Under Rail Expedition. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching. And I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.